So, Ethereum, Easter weekend. It's March 29th. I'm in this trade right now. I want to show you why I'm going short. You're probably thinking bananas, right? Because Ethereum's been ripping. Bitcoin's been ripping. But we have seen a bit of a pullback, all right? So we have a lower high, lower low, lower low, lower high. But then we start to get this climb, all right? So I'm going to just draw a nice little pretty trend line for you. Something kind of like that. I don't know. That's up, that's up for debate on how you would draw that, but that's close enough, right? So we got that. I also want to call your attention to this. We had this high here, right? But we never really cleared it here. We tapped it, but we didn't close above it. I'm on the four hour, by the way. Next, I want to draw your attention to this candle right here, which honestly is just a really big rejection. I mean, if you look at this whole chart here, this is a candle to notice that's been recent. So I'm going to go ahead and throw on some volume. Oh my goodness gracious. It had big volume too. Kind of a big deal. So next I'm going to draw a downward trend line here. Okay. I'll make that red. I want to, I want to make this pretty for you guys. You know what I mean? Taste the rainbow. We got to be a little colorful. Now you had a few options here for entry. I'm going to throw on two of my favorite moving averages, the hundred and the 200 on the four hour. We got this dirty crossover here. I mean, this is a bearish crossover, guys. Now, you had three options for entry. You could have gotten in at the break right there. Stop's probably going to go above that inverted hammer. You could have gotten up here on the retest where we came back and touched the two moving averages. Or you could have waited for the 10 EMA setup right there, which is, if you guys know, our homegrown strategy, which is the first bull candle closing under the 10 and we short below it. So, but for this, I did get in right at the moving averages, okay, on the retest. Stop is here. Target, I mean, ah, uh, this is a tough one, you know. Our multiples are important. Two to one, it's kind of the playbook, but uh, Ethereum's really strong right now. Crypto's really strong. BlackRock just dropped like $100 million into Ethereum, and, you know, they don't drop it in all at once. They have to buy it, like in bits and pieces. So this thing could rip out of here. I'm just going to target 1.5, even though my favorite number is all threes. I don't know. We're just going to do 1.5. Okay. 1.5 R right there. And you can see the trade's working so far. It's working really good. I've been in this trade for a few days now, so I am allowed to move my stop probably down to there. Okay. We're just going to call that the new stop. Yeah. So I'll let you know how this works out. Um, like I said, I love this trade for many reasons, right? Break of an upward trend line. We got the moving averages as resistance. Uh, I got a really nice spot for my stop. And I've got a target that I think is plausible, right? So don't forget to like, subscribe. That's the important one, guys. Subscribe. Subscribing helps us make these videos. It makes it all this possible. Turn on the notification bell. You're going to want to see these. We drop videos every single Wednesday at 11 o'clock central. You got to check them out. We're spitting fire, free education, free, and it's good. It works. Trust me. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Have an amazing weekend.